Cancer. Welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your general, general message for, mm, general message for, you know me and my dates, mm, July 29th through August the 4th. Okay, we're crossing over months here. All right, what is going on? What is going on, Cancer, for these seven little days? Thank you, angels. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What is going on for these seven little days? Just seven, just seven little days. Angels and guides, we need one more. Th oh, okay, angels. All right, all right. I know it's like I don't get to tell you what to do. You get to tell me what to do. I'm just the conduit. <laughs> okay, angels. What's thank you, thank you, thank you. Did you guys see that? Oh my gosh. Did you, did you, did you see that? All right, so just a little bit more. The angels are just like, whoa, they're not taking their time. We don't have to do microwavable tarot today. Mm -mm. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. What is going on for Cancer these seven little days? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> Okay, all right, come on, angels, what is going on? Just one more, just one more. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, maybe you might want to just fast, just go, just like that, fast forward until you see me drop the cards. Okay, angels, what is going on? One more, just, we just, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What is going on for these seven little days? Cancer, cancer. What is this? Nine of Wands reversed, Ace of Clubs, Queen of Spades. Okay, Cancer, what's going on this month? I feel like you have really, really come through a time when you didn't trust. There was some there was a lack of trust going on here, Cancer. And I feel like maybe someone wasn't speaking to you. Maybe someone wasn't talking to you, um, telling you something. Um, I feel like, I feel like, I feel like you're feeling better this week about trust issues, but I feel like you were going through trust issues. Um, I feel like there's new topics of conversation about trust issues, and I feel like this, like it's like really the queen of spades is like really really making you do some inner inner work as far as trusting um i feel that you might feel a little better i feel like you might feel a little better because you've gone through a lot in regards to trusting um who's in your circle yeah, who was in your circle. Okay, and, and I feel like these new topics, you, you, you're you digesting them. You're like, um, okay, I, I hear you go, okay, I'm gonna try this on for size, but it really doesn't fit me, right? It's almost like I'm used to not trusting people, okay? I'm used to doing that, and it felt right to me not to trust. Okay, so now you gotta trust. Now the universe is saying, no, you have to trust. Right, so it's almost like um, putting, you, let's say you wear a size four shoe. Hypothetically speaking, you wear a size four shoe, you're used to putting on a size four, and then someone says to you, okay, put on the size six. You're like, whoa, I don't wear this size, this doesn't fit, right? this does not fit. It's kind of like that with your trust issues. You're used to not trusting, you're used to looking over your shoulder and things of that nature. Now. Now you gotta trust. Now you gotta be somebody different and or a different shoe size, okay? So yeah. So let's let's get into this, okay? All right, now in the recent past, in the recent past, you have the you had the her hero font, font card with the ace of hearts and the five of diamonds. So in the middle of the in, in in the past, I feel like there was a commitment, okay? And this commitment does not have to be romantic because this is a general message, but it was definitely a commitment. It may have been a commitment with an institution, a business, uh, a bank, a, a person. It could even be a person, right? It could represent uh, a committed relationship or whatever it is committed, committed to a bank, committed to a job, committed to a relationship. And I feel like um, 
it had you changed i feel like you changed there was or and if you didn't change i feel like there was a lot a lot of travel in this definitely a lot of travel back and forth back and forth i feel now that was in the recent past i'm not saying it's over i'm just saying that energy was in the recent past now in the middle of the week we have the it's this is interesting we have the 10 the Ten of Swords with the Three of Spades and the Ten of Hearts. So, you know what's very, very confusing here is on one aspect, someone is asking you to trust, okay? Trust, I want you to try the shoe on, try the shoe on. And then I feel like, yeah, maybe you shouldn't have trusted. <laughs> maybe you shouldn't have trusted because I feel like it's, it's almost like somebody is just, oh, you find out something, I feel like you're finding out something that you, it's almost like someone convinced you to trust. Trust, 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 right? Put the shoe on. I know it's not who you are, but you put the shoe on. And then they didn't follow through. And you're feeling very hurt. You're feeling very, very hurt. And the three of spades is like you're feeling undecided about the situation, but you're not alone. I feel like, I feel like there's a lot of people around you that's going to help you through this, um, I want to say, I don't want to say dark night of the soul, but it's like, you know, when you build up your character so much and you decide to get to a healthy place and you're like, I'm not going to be that person anymore. And you get to that person. Like I'm, I'm, I'm here. I'm, I've changed. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to be that, that, um, that untrusting person. And then that person that you, that you built up that trust for lets you down. Um, that person um, makes you realize why you didn't trust, right? Makes you realize why, because now you're feeling the aftermath. And this is like, I feel this to my soul cancer. I really, really do. Like it's, it's affecting me on, on a very deep level. Um, there's lots of people around you that's going to help you through this situation. Okay. Now, by the end of the week, by the end of the week, we have the judgment card reversed. So I feel like what, with this, I feel like what happened, I feel like you weren't prepared. I, I feel like it was like you weren't prepared for it. I feel like you, um, and you feel like it's not fair. Like it's not fair, but it's also you, you just, you didn't see it coming. You didn't see it coming. And I feel like it's a secret. It's, there's definitely a secret that hasn't, it could be, you know what? And, and here's the thing. It could have been like, mm -hmm. Something dealing with work, like maybe maybe you were promised something, maybe you were promised something at work, and and maybe you were promised extra hours or or different shift or or it could be in a relationship, but whatever it was, it didn't come through. I feel like it didn't come through, but you expected it to come through because um, someone had discussed it with you, and you know, and and I feel like it was a constant discussion. So when when it's taken away, you're like, but wait, we discussed. This. We really, really discussed this. So let's get to the bonus. Okay. Now the knight, the knight of cups. Mm -hmm. I feel like there is love. There is love that is. Um, and now I, I, this is not a love read. So I'm going to say there is emotional support. There is emotional support coming to you in regard to the situation. And I feel like this emotional support is going to lift your spirits. Definitely lift your spirits. I feel like financially you're still good. There's there's no big major change in your finances. Um, I feel like there will be success around this. A lot of success. And I feel like your family is there. Um, I feel like your family is there. Your family has your back in this situation. Um, whether this be your family at home or maybe, may, you know, hypothetically speaking, maybe it is a job situation and you were promised something and don't worry, don't worry, you're gonna get this promotion, don't worry, and then you don't get it, right? Or, or you're with a partner and a partner is like, trust me, trust me, I would never do this, I would never, ever, e ever do this, right? And then they do it, right? And then you're like, uh, like what? Like you'd built yourself up to believe, to trust, and then it's like the rug was pulled out from underneath you. Well, have no fear. Have no fear because there is support around you. There is joy around you. There is There are people around you that is going to lift you up through this situation, okay? So, Cancer, I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.